right, what's happening around the Wat Valley? Well, going green is what a lot of businesses have been doing, but how about going green in the fashion world? Well, there's a fashion event happening April 1st, and that is featuring plant-based fashions, and Jade Storm, a plant-based designer, is leading the way for this event. Good morning, Jade Storm. Hi, How good are morning, you? Brad. Good, thank so, you, right, thank you. Before we go any further, I owe her apology, mm -hmm. and so she did. As soon as I walk in, I saw her. She's like, Brad, how many times have I been here? Brad, how many times have I designed a shirt for you? What's going on, Brad? How can you get my name wrong every <laughs> time? And, so, and then not just here, social media when I came in. So it's Jade Storm, not Jada Storm, which I keep on doing. How are you doing? Thank you. I'm amazing. <laughs> so Thank I apologize. You. you know, I'm not even good at my own kids' names. No. So there you go. It's okay. So um, this is great. Uh, what a perfect uh, time. One, the governor has lifted uh, the uh, mandate on how many people can be around. Um, two, we're looking to change how we are dressing in our fashion. Sure. So this event is coming at a perfect time, even though it's still social distancing, it's outside. You're excited. And I didn't know this, that this is at the Herberger in a, in a uh, outdoor kind of like setting. So mm -hmm. tomorrow's the fashion show. Yeah, it's a p outside pavilion at the Herberger Theater. So um, just before the sunset, so it'll be a nice, it'll be cooling off. Yeah. Um, gates open at at four thirty. Um, we're on at five, and then um, I am I'm bringing in a guest. I was trying to keep her a surprise. Yeah, you know, but you it's could, you it can't would, you it can't could. keep her a surprise. She's amazing. <laughs> Before we get to that surprise, let's talk about um, how important this event is actually going forward, especially as we saw um, clothing companies really um, not making clothes this past spring. One because of all the material they need to have, everything goes on. With this plant-based material that you use, it's it's hard to get in the way, but easier for designers to use this to, to save our planet. That's correct, yes, it is. And it is a little bit challenging to uh, understand new advanced materials, you know, and you have to have patience working with it because it is not gonna look like what you're used to um, taking off the shelves. You know, which is infused with the chemicals to basically make the structure a little bit different. So, yeah, yeah it is uh, easier for the designers to, to use to help save the water and the environment. That's the main focus for me for being a designer is I know that this brand will definitely help to uh, therapeutically treat the ocean and rivers and lakes, you yeah. know, with the, the non-chemicals and the herbs that's being used. In yeah. Um, because it's amazing when you start seeing documentaries about um, clothing, um, especially as how we treat it to third world countries, it's stacked up there. It is causing more havoc and everything. And we were talking about this, what you're designing, even the masks that you have designed, mm -hmm. they are actually biodegradable. That's correct. Um, so it's going to be great to go back into our, our soil and stuff because those chemicals aren't there. Um, but also what's really great too is that the fashion looks amazing. Like right now what your top is on, no one would think that is... Shabula. You know, there you go. It no one, is. Because everyone's so used to thinking of like the, you know, the, the bags or whatever, like the... Um, like the coffee bean bags and stuff like that. That's supposed to be your plant-based kind of outfit. But this right here where you designed and, and made yourself. Yes, mm -hmm. actually, and the jeans. Um, so we have denim um, that is 100% uh, organic cotton with the indigo instead of the chemical indigo. And then the blouse is uh, shibula. You know, the shibula it comes in uh, different colors. Uh, depends on what brand, what blend uh, the textile mill uses that um, I request. So this is an olive color in the green stage of the flowering, the flowering plant itself. And then of course the mask is the black stage, the more potent stage. But I feel it's very comfortable. It feels like butter. It's you know, <laughs> and, and, and like it's I like said, I'm butter. asthmatic, so you know, it's good for me to wear it. Yeah, and, and that's right now. Some people are at home going, "Gosh, you know, why am I, you know, breathing hard? Why is my asthma acting up or anything?" It could be the clothes that you're wearing that you might not realize because of the chemicals in here. And when you wash those and put them in the dryer, those chemicals kind of like come out a little bit more. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. With definitely. this material, it's not. That's why this event is so important tomorrow to come out and see what these designers are doing uh, with this plant base. And if you are a designer, you know, yourself, you might want to come and get involved Correct. and to see what you can start changing over to. So mm -hmm. again, four o'clock 
gates open. 430. 430, gates sorry, 430. 430 gates open. First 25 people through the gates get a free uh, biodegradable plant-based face mask. And um, I'll have sample fabrics there for people to look at. And then I'll be speaking in regards to the designs. Um, showing a more collection, focusing on men's dress shirts, as you know. Yep. But I'm going to be showcasing some pieces for women. And um, not very many, but we got 60 minutes yeah. you know, to, to, to explain and, and have right. fun. And, and it's open to the whole family. Yes. You want the whole family to come down to start learning. And again, it's outside. It's awesome. Um, you do have a special guest. Can we say a special guest? Can I? Please. She is a very good friend of mine who's coming in. Uh, it's Twinkle Time. Yeah. Uh, there she is. And she actually uh, has done some amazing music. She. Uh, did a song mask up mm -hmm. that you like, we all like. Mm -hmm. Her new uh, song out called Love mm -hmm. um, is amazing. And I'm hopefully she might be here on the show tomorrow. We'll see. I'm trying to get her in. But she will be there yes. performing, which is really great. Um, yes. Which is she's a child and adult star. People must love her everywhere. So she's going to be great to see in person. Yeah. So. Well, I just encourage everybody to come down and enjoy Twinkle Time. You know, if nothing else, you know, she is amazing, you know, and learn a little bit more about how to help reduce the carbon footprint. I like it. There it is. All right. Tell them uh, if they uh, need to get more information about the event, where can they go? If they need to get any more information about the event or even to just reserve that space for 25 people, they can go to mirrorimage.org or they can go to SWIA LLC. But Mirror Image uh, definitely is where we're hosting all of the, uh, the nonprofit that is hosting all of the reservations for the mask. Perfect. Jade Storm. Yes, sir. Thanks for being here. <laughs>